Early boost, quick boost coming in, and look at how deep Neck is. He spots a couple of people and is going to peel away. Yeah, quickly rummages way back. That flash is so good, though, on the repeat. As the I think it baited them into a false sense of security there. Keto, though, with two, and suddenly puts them on the back foot. Skulls has a flashed up Keto right for the taking. It's because there that takes him away. He runs out of ammunition. That P2000 has to replenish the magazine, and it's, it's not hard, man. It, it's hard, man. Like, it's a young man's game. Really? It's all this stuff. Honestly, he does, and I'm like, yeah, I will never do that. Firstly, I could never have done that even when I was 17, so that's there. Here we go. Another fast plate coming in towards B as Nekis will find the opening. Let's find the opening. Plenty of mollies, but also being extinguished. 3 0 already, so Payne feeling even more pressure to deliver on this map. And this round right here, right now. Hodge out behind the van. Has dropped the bomb. And he's able to back away as well. This is suddenly looking pretty solid for the CTs. They do have two very weakened players, though, perched at the bench side of the site. If Tabson can line them up, they could both be knocked down. And that's going to be the case, but it's Crimbo that steps up and delivers. It's Crimbo that is shattering some dreams for the Brazilians. And now Big Azera has to try and navigate his way into the site. The bomb is still yet to be planted. He knows where one of the players is. Precisas de novas skins? Registra-te em CSGO Fest e faz os teus teammates invejosos. Dá boost na tua inventoria em alguns cliques. Coloca o promo code e obtém bônus. Link na descrição do vídeo. Go, go, go! Nice shot. Right. Because Zero has no idea, he's being flanked from behind. The CT player has no clue either. Because Zero, he should be dead to rights here. Primbo is aware. I think he saw the barrel. We're still going to walk on through the smoke. And Because Zero, how is he still alive? I'm starting to think that he didn't see the barrel. Maybe the uh, the X-ray is is lulling us into a false insecurity. But Big Azera certainly was. He had no idea that Crimbo was there. And although he was uh, very fortunate not to get fragged earlier in the round, eventually Karma will collect. Skulls will be joined by Hajar momentarily. But there's flashes and smokes being exchanged, locking off connector, flash into the peak. Good kill from Skulls. A very important kill at that. And I don't think Harjao has given his position away, although the assist would have flagged up with the flashbangs. They have a good idea as to his position. 37 health left on Crimbo, but they forced the plant down. And now Keto probably going to be called upon to go big because it's unlikely that his teammate's going to survive much longer. As I say that, though, he does pass a bullet through the head, albeit through the wall. So he's weakening up players left and right. Two of them are low. Hajao is the only player on 100, and he's now been sent packing. Double spray from Keto. This would be a horrendous round for Payne to lose. They have to grab on top of this one. Zevi's going to wide swing and gets the kill. It's going to be close on the defuse, but he does have it. the kit, and he should have the time. Payne get the round, but... We'll have to use the smoke to his advantage and play around the periphery, around the side of it. He's not biting down on that bait of the bomb being planted. He still has his eyes trained on Palace, and Hajao with the MP9 needed that kill and has picked it up, but Crimbo returns fire. Big Azera is about to show his hand from the jungle. And Zevi, it shows the importance of Zevi staying alive. He can act as that linchpin for his teammates to play off on a big, big kill at the end. B bloodshed is inevitable. And only mere moments away. Smoke down from Harjao allows him safe passage back onto the van. This big Azera, even while flashed, it's dropped. Two players with the 5-7. Nekis with the Deagle also goes in. My goodness, with a low investment buy. Flash is good. Process in the trade and anti-flash. Just look at it. Kia just walking out, taking matters into his own hands. They find one, but Big get two in return. Now, Big Azera has a lot of work to do. He's going to be harassed here. He's going to be pushed here. The wide swing from Keto, and he is taking no prisons today here, Vince. Him Bruh. and Crimbo. The double K. And they're just getting all the kills. I think Process is aware. Maybe not. Looks away at the last second. Hards out. It's trapped in the corner. We'll find one, but Tapson there to trade with the AWP and all on neck is right now. Big are running away on this half. The way to total up, this is interesting. They've completely given up mid. Player towards balcony and Zevi on the side finds process. So that's at least something to open things up. But still the deadly duo of Keto and Krimbo still very much alive. Tapson brings out the SG. 
and he will fall as well. <laughs> and wrecked. <laughs> I was kind of starting to set him up there, but yeah, absolutely wrecked. Crimbo, that smoke is a bit of a one-way, standing on top of the couch, but Neck is, will sneak his way out. I think Crimbo might be aware here. He has the molly as well, but it's almost like he doesn't want to give his position away. Keto, in the meanwhile, made short work over. Oh, Crimbo. He may have second-guessed himself. I think he was maybe anticipating like a flash into a peak. They did this in the pistol round. I think it was Hard Zhao got the kill off the back of it. But now hyped. One on five. There's the first. Any kills? Now, for the side of Big, it's a different thing altogether because Favon, he's not out of the team. He's going to be coming back. So I guess they're not going to be really swapping too many things out as Nekis is going to take matters into his own hands. Finds a kill onto Krimbo and is pushing into its underpass. And Hardzow is going to make contact. Doesn't oh. get the kill, but he does somehow get the tag. Very nice cleanup from Big Azera. Taps in last. And yeah, I, sorry, I kind of made that. What? Because that looked like it should have been. A That's it. He can bring the pain here for Big. Yeah, this is the question. How are they going to CT side with a standing situation? Come charging on in. Smoke for stairs. Jungle not for CD. Just looking to take the duels. And Hard Zhao is making it clean. But the stand in. We took his name. And he's going to find two from Connector. And all of a sudden, it is a one versus two for Big Zera. And he will. Oh, the labor tap. And he will <laughs> fall. The smoke timing is very nice on the side of Big. They're actually not going to be giving this away. They just rush straight on onto Tetris. Trying to carve a path and take a mantle out of Big's playbook of just run and gun. No respect, just entry frags. 30 seconds now. We can play is pushing towards the site. The bomb's been put down from Process. Another big play from that man. And Thompson's going to clean up the rest. Skulls will be the last man standing in the smoke. Hoping and praying that this flank from Crimbo isn't successful. And Crimbo guesses right as well. He knows it's Palace. He is there, ready, willing, and able to take the head of Skulls and make it... The rotation starting to come on in. They've just given up B, uh, B for the time being, but Hearts are still looking around. Man, Crimbo is undeniable right now. The guy is fragged out on it. The T side now he's carrying it over on the CT side. He's over 100 ADR by the way. 21 kills, 100 ADR to his name. Tons and tons of opening picks. Just unbelievable performance from him. And I completely agree with you. There's a lot of caveats you can put into place, but at the end of the day, some of their key members have not shown up. They have not arrived to the server yet. Skulls, a player that you're normally looking at to be one of those guys that's up there, 49 ADR with seven kills. And it's not even as if they've been completely like battered in terms of opening kills. I'm looking at the stats here. It's fairly even. Like Big are ahead in opening kills, but the amount of times they've came back from a, a one or two player deficit has been massive. They may have to do it again here though. This pain is starting to spill out onto the site. 18 seconds to play with Crimbo Sandwich. Keto also on the ramp. That's a labored spray that's going to cost him his life, plus the life of Hard Zhao. And although the bomb plant does come in, Zevi flash. Every single conceivable way, Big have been the better team. And so for Payne to, to try and get a, a stranglehold over this, it's looking incredibly unlikely. Even more so as Nekis and his woes continue. Maybe finishing this map on seven kills and 50 ADR or thereabouts. Taps and having zero chill. Wants to put this to bed as fast as possible. This game, of course, was delayed because the previous one went on so, so very long. So maybe Big trying to catch up for lost time. Pain now making moves over on the B side of the map, however, but they're going to dart through underpass instead because they do have the linchpin of Skulls, who is positioned in Palace. So if he can have some impact here, there is still a way forward for the Brazilians to make a go of this and make it a little bit more of a respectable scoreline. But Keto's not interested. Instantly peeks in for Connector. Oh, it's two headshots and he does loads of damage to Zevi as well. So at 15 seconds, this is looking like the final curtain is coming down and it does. Usually going to have Crimbo playing towards ramp. And for pain. It's do or die time. Backs against a wall have to win both this and the deciding map which is vertigo in order to ensure they survive elimination the pressure is definitely on in the brazilians quite a lot of damage being double and taps and will finish up big as arrow meantime zevi 
down to one hp as well the flashes will come on in but yeah it's an absolute shutdown here hard zhao he's been spotted as well bomb dropped on the bomb site and then i think they knew where zevi was i oh, know actually no i think he was able to cross on through the smoke so that was unconfirmed damage to a zevi but still a five versus two the cds don't even have a kit but they don't even need one because the bomb's right there yeah, it's in a very dicey position, and they still haven't dealt with Process, who's perched up on top of the hut. So even if they can wiggle their way out somehow onto the bomb, they're likely to get splattered by three players that are all pincered in. We have their eyes trained on the prize of those Brazilians, and it will be a clean sweep round. Flashes into a push as Quito, if he goes unchecked, he is going to get a barrage of bullets finding its way onto those Ts. And just with the MP9, a bonus, yielding the kill. And 25 seconds, multiple angles for the CT to try and hold this one. Tapson tapping his way into two kills. No one checks Crimbo. Whips the first spray, but does capitalize with the second. And the Hyped bomb. has the player advantage, but the bomb is down. Hyped doesn't want to give his position away. 50 HP left. He's really trying to bide his time here. He knows he has to stick onto the bomb. USP whips so to it. And they've already lost skulls in this, the seventh round. Money starting to accrue nicely on the CT side. Keto looking for the up and over. Flash process lines them up, sprays them through the smoke to first. And the second just walks into his crosshair. And Payne, please call a timeout or something, boys. This is not working right now. They just did. <laughs> they just did a couple of rounds. And this is, this is a nuke from seven eight years ago where it was like super ct sided no it's 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 a very different way this new plays out nowadays so clearly the multiple things going wrong here but at least it's evident you can see what the problems are you can see like the individuals are really working out here so hopefully they just approach it with a positive mindset and to fix it because this is looking grim neck is at least able to sneak on in but taps in there as a contingency as hard are at least able to crack open I don't really crack open the bomb side yet. He's getting one kill. He's down at 30 HP, and we, uh, he's, he's got some time. He's got the bomb, but it's looking unlikely. On the bright side, Nekis has a kill, but now he's tied up with Skulls and one apiece. Pan Zevi. Yes. Like, normally, looking at Zevi and Skulls to have a lot of impact, the two of them have two kills, and collectively, what, like 60, 65 ADR, and that's going to probably change after this round to more like 60. No bomb plants. It's been very dire. Like, there's no way of sugarcoating it. It's been a pretty horrendous game so far on the side of Pain, although Big have been playing exceptionally well. But you're absolutely spot on. Their CT side is very, very strong. They can get four or five rounds. This is still doable. Skulls hiding, anticipating the smoke to clear. And this is much better as Hard Zhao makes Crimbo catapult into his collapse. And now only Hyped and Tabson remain. They're looking to try and whittle down some of this economy. Give Tabson his second death of the map. Hyped getting aggressive. Wants to fight fire with fire. But if he overextends, there is a player towards Squeaky that's going to have him dead to rights. That Skulled. Tabson at the back of the site. He's been sawn point with his aim. So yes, the second you see him, get the hell out of there. Do not try and fight him. Tapson, I think, is going to get caught here by Vigas Era, and he is a dead man. So, pain! The moment he opens the windows, he knows the jig is up. He's going to go for uh, the utility to try and prevent the rotation from taking place. But Tapson still finding Zevi, still maintaining the player advantage, and now they're going to come charging in. Now the rotation comes in as well as Keto will be caught by Vigas Era. It's Hype's turn to make something happen here. Oh, he had the right idea. That flash isn't going to affect him. That's the bomb down. And a two kills for height. Molly to the back of the site as well is going to make Nekis very uncomfortable on 15 HP. It is too hot to handle as he charges back into the vents. But there is a player there waiting for him. He's going to be rotating back. Still 40 seconds on the clock. Pain starting to group up together. And taps and he goes poking and prodding and he will be taken down. This is uncomfortable now for Big. Out of their comfort zone for the first time in a while. Spray is awry and Process can't quite get it done. But Hyped, oh, that's oh. a nice flick. That's the bomb that drops with it. 15 seconds left. Trying to stall him a bit longer. Molly to the back of the site already. Peering in, anticipating a peek comes through. 
Oh, he misses that shot. That was much easier than the first one. He connected, unfortunate. Just a little bit of a movement before the shot went out. Now, Krimbo is the next to fall. Skulls is waking up. The Gush comes on in. The player mains through the smoke, and it's going to be a retake. Play Zevi, though, finding taps, and that's a big kill to find. They do have a kit and a nade as well to work with, and a player advantage. So this is still very much within the realm's possibility here for Pain. Three players going to be coming on up from above. I guess with the nade. Hyped, waiting. Oh, the Molotov. The timing on that is brutal. Certainly is. That bomb is still ticking away as well. Here comes Hyped. Crimbo. The time is so low. They have no kit. They need to pick it up. They which have just done now, but I'm not sure there's enough time for this one. They have to stick on there. And here comes Keto. Switches to the knife and backstabs. But Pain's got the And convert that as well. And suddenly 11 to 9. It's so much more closer. And you're starting to feel confident as well. Flashback comes out. Look at Team Flash there. Nekis, he needs to find a multi-kill. Is good for just the one, though. Zavis are waiting inside of the vents. Timing is everything. He's made footsteps. But it's all a bait. Because Zero finds Keto. Zevi with a second kill for his team as taps and will reply back. Is left alone in a one versus two. And he makes it into a 1v1. 19 seconds on the clock. All picked up as well. Love it. He knows he has no room for error. So he's going to take that AWP and try and put it down range. Used to AWP in the past. We know he can use it. Our oh, shower is an incredibly one sided map is now well and truly up for grabs. Big Azera will claim the second frag of the round and with 20 seconds to play with and all three have big clumped together in Squeaky, it does not bode well to any success here on the German side. Will they try a vent dive? They will indeed, and all three of them successfully get down there, but that's only half the problem because Zevi and Nekis are both waiting. Nekis, he's had a rough game and it continues that way. Hype does get a pick, but it's a 1v3. Draws out the play, there's no time. He can't do anything anyway, and he dies after time. Because of the lobby crunch, Big are like, all right, there shouldn't be anyone outside. Because Zera has been spotted though, but he doesn't dare face. It's a smart play from him. Oh, great flashbang. Great flash from Hardzow. So despite Bigazera falling, he does get a kill before he gets taken down. And Krimbo, he gets stuck into vents very early in the round. But the timing has been sweet for Pain, but Prosos now has a chance, but he turns his back, and Hardzow will punish him. The bomb still gets planted down, but Keto's going to be fragged from above, and Krimbo in no position to deal with this. The bomb is not planted for him. The Molotov is going to keep him at arm's reach, and this round will be the Brazilians, and it will be them seven rounds in a row. But yeah, as long as Nekas and Zevi, they have his crossfire set up, this is, this is brutal. But hyped, ready. And now it's down to Neckers to make something happen. It's not landing anything. All he can do right now is try to stay alive. While the waits are back up to arrive. Timing. Oh, almost gets a kill on the player there. As Taps and spraying blindly through the smoke. He's going to find hards out. And all of a sudden... With weapon of choice. I'd be very happy with that. Big Zera still holding to what's outside. Smoke wall there. Maybe Taps and in process. The timing on that. The timing on that is brutal. Taps and finds hard out with Bigger Zero still alive. And now he won't be expecting this. The barrel's been seen as well. In process, he's going for the long con. He's playing the long game here. This is so smart for him. And finally, he will strike. And now Skulls. Oh, he is in such an uncomfortable spot here. Oh, what a frag from Prosos that is, and he is going to get pushed from heaven. And that push could yield so much for Nekis. He gets two on the rifles to make this work. 45 seconds now. No contact being made. Big are waiting patiently for Pain to make a play. But Pain, they are they're very comfortable just turtling up, just not showing themselves. And I said it earlier, Vince, with Pain not seeing anything, not having any information. Big is there going for a play and he gets punished. And this could be 2k here. This could be huge for Zevi. Finds one. But doesn't push far enough, so Krimbo won't be able to trade, but still a 4v4. And now 17 seconds. They need to go for a play here. That's a very important kill. 10 seconds left. If that went the other way, that would have had decon control available for Pain, and they could have denied the bomb plant. As it stands, Evie comes downstairs. It's a very scrappy fight, but one that he comes out the better of. Flashbang. Did he flash himself? I think he pushed a bit too early. Otherwise, I'm pretty sure Hyped would have been dead. He gets it on the second time of asking anyway. There is a rotational play from Krimbo who wants to get down on the vents, but he's going to have to pick up the pace. 
because it's all on Tapson and he's on 10 HP, so he's playing this very, very passively. Now the defuse comes in. Bomb not planted for Crimbo, and Zevi's watching, and Zevi is there for an ace. Another ace picked up, 26. Still, Zevi is alive on 36 HP, but very much alive and kicking, and neck is a tux. Oh, he tucks in, but Crimbo immediately dispatches with him. Big Zara is gonna go big. Three kills for him. Hype will reply, but it's a 3v2 here, favoring pain. Six. Sick, sick play with the FAMAS. I believe that was from Big Azera. Keto now, though, may get the drop. He's not going to check his angles. Evie's not going to miss that no-scope. And now it's down to the other AWPer. 20 seconds to have his say. Y you wouldn't knock him if he decided to save this AWP, to be honest. But he's going to go in for it. 10 seconds now. And he's a goner. Skulls was sat. He's going to channel his own inner taps in. Big. They're looking to go for the crunch process. We'll find Big Azera, but Zevi from above delivers depth, but a quick trade from Taps. 32 kills to the veteran. Keeping the big dream alive. They have no idea. Crimbo has just snuck his way out all the way onto the site. One player heaven, one on the boxes, who's now been fragged in the form of Tapson. Now, Nekis is going to be able to show his hand. The bomb's going to get planted down. Nekis goes in for another one. On 9 HP, he survives, but not for much longer. And now, fittingly, it's going to be Tapson for the 4K, for the 1v2 clutch. And he's not able to put it into play. Skulls takes his toe. Is it going to be quick enough, though? I don't think it will, because Bigger just darting downstairs ever so quickly. He does. He does catch Tapson. 34 kills and done for now. Zevi is spoilt for choice. Takes his kill, stays in position. 25 seconds. Crimbo moving in, using that smoke as a bit of cover. Flash is in, be planting in amongst the smoke as well. And Hyped goes in, takes down Nekis in the process. There is an AWP in the grass, and it's in the hands of Zevi who gets spotted. <laughs> and Hyped is like, nope. And he's going to try his best to clutch this one on three. Flash to Decon, and there's Biggest Error on the clean sweep headshot. He just, just doesn't care. He's like, I'm just going to take a fight and kill them all. Oh, he gets the tag. The edge of the door, though, and he will be taken down, and that's a danger, man. And here comes Big charging out. They, they know there's a player there in the smoke, but Big Zero from above will finally fall to CT, staring down towards Keto as a, oh, the two T's are going to drop down. And okay, taps the patience on him to be on the ladder. And now the 3v2. This is moving in. It was a weakened hype that's now been found out from Nekis. Keeps himself alive in the windows. A weakened hard Zhao. The culling of the Meek coming into play and Nekis walks into town. Let's see what they go for. So there it is. He hears information. Puts the incendiary down. He gets two kills. They just run out against him. That's the bomb down as well. And Krimbo's been found by Zevi. This round has come apart at the seams. Smoked out as well. And now Skulls around the back. He may not get all the kills, but he's put Keto onto 3 HP. It is a tried and tested T strat. But playing a lot more passively and deeper on the sites. Now watching the cross. Taps and taps in. Doesn't yield any kills. He was getting those all day, every day earlier on, but it has allowed Keto to move in. And now it's his time to shine. Molotov off. The weakened Taj out. Will not be peeking behind that. Skulls playing with his food, but actually devours Brosis. A kill probably the rookie should have been picking up. But Crimbo now is going to get aggressive. However, Skulls is already anticipating this, just watching the angle. And even though he's on low HP, probably gets this kill as well. Dinks him, finishes him off. And Hyped also goes the same way. We're headed to OT2, barring a Keto miracle. And that's not going to happen. So we go again. Player towards ramp. Three on the side, no one towards heavens. Look at the amount of real estate. That pain have taken, and now they go in for the push. They realize they have to go for a play here. Now they know where Keto is. Hyped. Oh, what a shot on the skull. Wow. Zap the bomb as well. What a reaction play from Big. And suddenly the tables have been turned, and Zevi and Big Azera have to somehow wrest this one back from Big. Wow, I'm so impressed with Hyped. He's, he's not just a flick merchant. Like, he actually gets a lot of static kills as well. He's kind of a jack of all trades with this AWP. Very good stuff from him. It's not over just yet, though. Big Azera and Zevi certainly have an uphill climb. Make no mistake. But they have more than enough power to make it work. There's still incendiaries and flashes and HEs, though. This is a huge task ahead of them as they move out. Molotov and Hyped, who's going to go in for the peak. Misses the shot this time around, though. And that could prove to be so costly. 
because there is enough time oh, for the no. plant, but here comes Crimbo, and there is the denial. They can pick the bomb back up. I'm not sure if Zevi probably had enough time, but actually lands the shot. And now Zevi sees the bomb is in the hands of Hard Zhao. Now Kito needs to get some kills from this position. Anticipating the flashes, and he comes out second best. And that's going to be free reign to run down on the fence. And Biggest Error is there to cut off the rotation and the reinforcements. Process now darting back down on the ramp side, but the bomb is being planted in. All right, Hype looks, waits, anticipates. Hard Zhao has the flash. Waiting for his teammates to come in. Hype just mistimes it. Process moving in, loses his life to Zevi. And now it all stacks on Hype's shoulders. He switched across to the M4 to have that mobility in his favor, but he has no idea where these three T's are. And Zevi's going to have him all day, every day. Move to also, third. the other side of that coin, and Zevi has just been a man possessed past that first 10 or so rounds in this match. But he has gone down. 35 seconds, a week in process. It's finished off. Bomb on the ground. Keto once more won't find it. And hype goes down as well. The timing on these peaks could not be sweeter on pain. It seems like we are going to have a tied affair one more time. Crimbo had no idea. And 20. Got across the vertigo. Only time will tell. Hypes has missed his shot. And Skulls gets two. Two from the hut. And still about half of his HP remaining. Oh, this start is brutal for big. Phenomenal if you're pain. And Skulls will not find a third. Crimbo tries he made to spin around and pivot in for two. Cannot get it done. And now Tapson needs to pick up where he left off in that first half. It's been a while. But Nekis drops to his death. Tapson pivots in. But no pain now about just yet. Keto snuck his way downstairs. May get the oh. drop. Nekis should be a dead man and is. Just for a second there, I thought Keto had missed his chance. But Tapson... Just a little bit delayed on the peak. Will not spot Zevi. Hop back into hell. 35 seconds right now. Zevi shows himself. Get, takes damage, but spots information. He sees two players outside. And it stands to reason this is going to be an A hit now. So Hard Shower is coming back up again. Skulls has had so much impact from these positions. In comes Tapson. The biggest error is good enough to thwart his push. And now Skulls from above is going to strike. This should be it. Pain should be taking us to a third map. Unless Crimbo can clutch, which he can't. Pain win. And we're headed to Vertigo. But they brought it back, and here we are on Vertigo. A fast B play coming in from Pain. It's rapid, and it's relentless. The process and Keto looking to try and quell this push, and it's been successful. Neck is hiding in the smoke, has got one, but is that going to be able to turn this around on its head? All of his teammates have fallen around him. This Glock needs to go to town, 50 HP remaining. Keto very low behind the pillar, but he is safeguarding the bomb. They don't want to give Nekis two separate 1v1s because he can absolutely capitalize on that, especially if the first to fall is process. Meanwhile, though, because of how fast and rapid this round was, there's still way more than a minute left on the clock. And there is the next kill. He knows what process is. Goes for the peak. Goes the for the smoke. Swing. Process. Oh, now he's got to go for the play here and he's going to find one. But good trades as Hype trying his best to ameliorate the damage but he will fall in keto he was down on 14 hp at the beginning of the round and unfortunately for him i don't really fancy his chances here 1v3 deagle out already six kills to his name comes into this map on fire flashbang ah. dangerous game to play for keto he's gonna be flash out of position but crimbo his time to shine gets to kill 19 seconds need to go for the play here and a missed shot in crimbo he's gonna strike and he's gonna shut it there's been a few weird moments here from the individuals of pain on this map. Like players you expect, like Skulls, like Zevi, to really pop off as Keto should be hunted down, but he finds both and the third as well. Okay, Keto's back, Vince. 12 and 2. He might have been a bit absent on Nuke, but he is making a statement now. 13, he's on a 4K, he's on for the ace. If oh, Hard Zhao so tries to push... Early kill. Still a minute and 30 seconds remaining on the clock. And look at the regression coming up from Primo. He's feeling it. He's really feeling it. And the smoke's actually going to help him out a bit. But through the smoke, they will get the frags and the third as well. And Process has a lot of work to do now. Oh, no. I think he's hearing all the T's run back down ramp, though. There's one. He's low HP. 38-3 to his name. Double spray is good. But it doesn't leave Hype with too many options now with his AWP. 
It's not a gun that's tailor-made for rapid quick-fire kills. He's having a bank on the idea of this being a B-sided push. This is an absolute disaster round for Big. One by one, they pushed into the oncoming Tech Nines and various assortment of pistols. That really played into the benefit of Paint. Just when you thought Big would extend their lead even further. And Hyped, he did gamble onto the B-play. That doesn't seem to be... The correct decision, not that it was his fault, of course, and now it allows the T's to get up close and personal with the AKs they've picked up. Yes, Bigger's error is low, but Skulls has Kevlar and 100 HP. They're going to plant for the back room, but Hyped is in hot pursuit. They have tons of cash, tons of surplus cash here to the CT, so he can justify going in for this. But I'm not sure he's going to check to his left-hand side. Now, that plant should give him an idea as to what's going on. The biggest error Allows shuts him side down. control. And Hard is going to go straight for the plant. Nothing there to stop him. A HE does connect, and it is true. But not enough to deal the fatal damage. And now all the CTs come crumbling down. And pain. He does like taking a lot of these aggro duels we've seen. Uh, we've, seen this across, we've seen this across all the maps as well. Oh, what a flash. What a flash. Spacing on his two flashes, but Crimbo doesn't care. No, oh, certainly not. The only thing that's working in their favor is the time, but they've just lost Nekis, and with his life, the bomb also falls. Constantly picked off, whether it be through Zevi or Bigger Zero or one of the entry fraggers. Tabs are now forced out of position on side, and he's walking through the fire and flames. Nearly lined up for a double. Skulls down to 10, that's the bomb. But it's still 40 seconds. There's still a chance back in here for Paint with 16 kills. Still stand tall. Looking to deliver. Up from Zevi, though, is true. His aim on point for two more two kills. One point, Vince, and ever since then, only able to string, not even string, but get a couple of sporadic rounds in between. For Pain, though, decent resurgence, and now the CT side. Zevi's gonna start things off. For the duel, he's lying in wait as well. Zevi will be plucked. Zera, he was just lying in wait. Coil gets three kills. How what? does he get three kills? Someone tell me. And that's why, ladies and gentlemen, like we saw the first game a complete storm from Big. The second one, new, my favorite game of the day. I think that was incredible, going all the way to uh, to double OT as well, 22 and 20. So I think fittingly, I would like to wrap up this day with a close series, and that is what we're having here as Tapson. We'll get a trade. He knows where Bigger Zero is. Bigger Zero just waiting with a smoke in his hand. The backup has arrived. Yeah, while well, that smoke is on the sandbags, he is safe and he knows that. No more mollies. Oh, but he's lost his partner. He's lost his safety net on the site of Zevi. And Keto will exploit that, expunges him, annuls that partnership. And in doing so, the site may fall. Under the wrong hands, as far as Pain are concerned. The MP9 sprays on point from both Skulls and Heart Shao simultaneously, one of which was through smoke in the head. And that's absent. Has to play the angle. The bomb is planted for him, but he has no utility here. Neither do the CTs. So down to aim and Skulls so prevail. Now will be deployed. 50 seconds on the clock, unfortunately, for the CT, for, for the T's. They have no control towards B. Bombs being spilled towards short, and this is looking rough for big. Uh, Crimbo last alive. They know where he is on the ramp. There's four players left. The bomb is to his left-hand side. And Zevi. So it's still looking like it's a very likely round for pain, but maybe they can force a plant before they go down. Or not. <laughs> Had to say it. Hype, though. He sees one. He expects a second. Flashbang. Will be avoided, but they do get the bomb down. Set. As Crimbo, okay, they're pushing in. They're pushing in. The flash is good. That's a team flash, and they're just falling apart. It's all down out of Zevi in a 1v3, Vince. And he's not gonna manage to pull it off. They can stack oh, four boy. players on B because of this, and Zevi takes the kill on process, tags hype through him. Oh no. Cue the Jaws it's music. Dun, 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 dun. Oh, he's got a strike. He finds two. He still doesn't know there's a third player there. He actually spins around, doesn't really matter though. Skulls with the trade and height. Oh, he got the second kill. I just looked away for a second. I didn't see the kills. I just saw the kill feed and just, what? Yeah, White swung the scaffolding and just absolutely obliterated two players, but Zevi is still alive at the back. Oh, the spray. Oh, wow. the shutdown. This is a kill zone. And Big have walked head first in here. Maybe baited in from the- Rimbo, this is, this is not impossible. 
Absolutely. Oh, did no one swing? They don't face, but he finds one. 18 seconds now. Now he's going to stick it. There is a chance, Vince. Hold up. Hold up. There's a very good chance. There's a great chance for Crimbo oh! and Impossible. It's nothing for this man. 30 seconds now. Big have four players left. You have three rifles. That will remain the case, even though Nekis has picked up one. On to Keto. That was their Tech 9 wheel. The hype pin spins around, but they haven't checked side. They haven't checked biggest error. And that will be to their see Crimbo. The trajectory of this grenade is going to give him a little bit of information. Smoke down, preemptively expecting a rush. And an aid behind it. Skulls in on Keto. It's going to be pushed again from Tabson. But Harjao cleaning it up. And Payne will live to fight another day. Big are eliminated. Oh, that was, that was a game. That was a game of Counter-Strike. And listen.